Perfect tire saver. Remove the cap. Cool. Remove the valve stem core. The only hard part in this whole project is don't lose this valve stem core. Okay, so we're letting the compressed air out of the tire. I can no longer hear the air coming out, but I want to wait a few more seconds because I can still feel the compressed air coming out of the tire. And we're going to fill the tire with nitrogen. We're going to release the lock, put it on the valve stem, and we bring the, the tire up to the manufacturer's recommended pressure, in this case 32 PSI. And at that point, what we will do is we will dump the air back all the air back out of the tire again, I say air, it's going to be nitrogen at this point. And what we want to do is we want to bring the percentage of nitrogen up by filling it the second time. Okay, we're up to 32 PSI. We're going to release the trigger. We're going to release the valve stem core. Install the valve stem core back in the valve stem with the tool. And we're going to fill it with nitrogen. Takes a little time, so fortunately the tire saver weighs 2.6 pounds. The nitrogen is a larger molecule in a tire, so the probability of that nitrogen molecule remaining in that tire as compared to oxygen or helium or argon or the other inner gases is very, very good. The larger molecule will not pass through the sidewall of the tire like the small molecule will. Thus the result is that you've got air that stays in the tire where it belongs. The car will get better fuel economy, will ride better, you'll get much better life out of the tire, all because you're keeping and maintaining the proper pressure, in this case 32 PSI. As with compressed air, you should check your tires to make sure that pressure stays up. I'd recommend checking every month or so. Nitrogen, you'll find that that pressure will remain and you won't have to check as often. If you just use compressed air, about every 60 to 90 days, you're going to be putting some compressed air back in it because that's just the way the tire's made. It's porous, it's going to leak. We're going to place a green valve stem cap into nitrogen. It tells people not to put compressed air in. It's okay if you need to, but heard a thing. But you want to keep your purity of your nitrogen so when you have a choice, refill with a Parker tire set.